<laughs> Extra low prices. How nice. It's time. It's time. It's here. The big November sale ends October 26th. Don't miss it. There's something Lazarus happening for you. Eric Warren and Eyewitness 12 News. They get involved. Live from WKRC-TV, it's the Ira Joe Fisher Show. Q102, high atop the beautiful WKRC studios on Mount Auburn. Just trying to drum up a little business, and we're celebrating Squirrel's birthday, third annual birthday. Squirrel, yeah. bless your heart. You know, we have never done this before, and I see why it's real uncomfortable. It's yeah. horribly crowded in here. It's a little warm in here, isn't it, with these uh, spotlights we got in here? But I want to know, when are we going to put on the dippy party hats? <laughs> I already have mine on. Oh, I thought they should have called you Unicorn. I didn't know. But how do you feel about your birthday celebration? I'll tell you what. I love birthdays. Let me tell you something. Ho the holidays. It's going to be long, Squirrel. No, no. Thanksgiving, Christmas, and all the holidays belong to everybody. Everybody celebrates Christmas and Thanksgiving and Fourth of July together. But on your birthday, you celebrate it just by yourself because it's your birthday. It's your special you know, day. This, this seems like an episode from the Walton Squirrel. I'm, <laughs> I'm so touched. I've never heard anything more beautifully put in my life. Joyce, how do you feel at this I moment? Feel, I feel great. And don't think that we came up here empty-handed. Oh, no, sir. First of all, our famous Ira Joe Fisher show, Donut for You. I make a wish. Second of all, we have the Ira Joe Fisher show apron because, Squirrel, we know you're always cooking. <laughs> And Ira Joe Fisher Show keychain, but you'll notice we didn't put the key to our office on there because we don't really trust you. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Ira, that was Squirrel Donut. Okay, I'll give it back. Carol Acer Cano. <laughs> so how old are you, Squirrel? 41. And are you looking forward to being 42? Yes. Okay. And 43 and 44 and the rest of them. So what, what, what other uh, things have you planned for the bash today? Um... I just basically take it a day at a time. And I, right now, right now I'm working on getting past 10 o'clock, you know, <laughs> when this party's over. You're, you're a little bit worried? Yes, okay. yes. Well, we are delighted to be a part of the celebration. Jim Fox is here. Chris O'Brien is here. Uh, Shive's in there doing the news or wanting to do the news. And we have just a, a ma magnitude of people who are here and joining us. There we are just showing you some of the people who are here and Friends, celebrating. Shut the mailman. <laughs> and Chris O'Brien, does, does Squirrel put you up to this? Does he force you guys to do this? You know what? About, about, a, about a month ahead of Squirrel's birthday, I find a little note, corner of my office, just right there on the corner of the table, and it says, only 24 more shopping days to my birthday. Only 23. How can you not know that it's coming up? You know what I think is a nice touch, because it's here early in the morning, the way you've passed out little eight ounce brown bottles of Listerine. I just uh, <laughs> think that's just a wonderful touch, Squirrel. Well, we figure anybody that's here at seven o'clock in the morning uh, should not have to go to the office with bad breath. <laughs> so, uh, well, I think that's a heck of a deal. We, Squirrel, happy birthday. Oh. This is the third annual birthday party celebration live from Q102. We're gonna take a break. When we come back, we're gonna chat with Mary Wilson. Yes, oh. also, I just like to make it clear that there are only seven shopping days left till Ira Joe's birthday. Oh. So. Oh. Don't fuss. We'll be right back, will you? <laughs>